What we have done is, is develop a methodology uh, which consists in two main uh, tools. One is for diagnosing and measuring resilience in cities. We have a, a number of indicators we retrieve, we gather data and information, and based on that data and information, we analyze and we pass a diagnosis to the city. But we also have another, which is recommendations for actions. And, uh, and we calibrated this methodology in four main cities. Develop it together with Barcelona, calibrated with four cities, Asunción, Dakar, uh, Maputo and Port Vila. So the main rationale of the city resilience program is to make sure that we have um, a more friendly and uh, more robust and more resilient city. Existem muitos problemas nas cidades, desde as questões climáticas, económicas, sociais, e se uma cidade tiver essa capacidade de responder a esses problemas, ela se torna melhor e mais resiliente, não é? This word resilience is a word that is being more and more used. Uh, it's more frequent now in the discourses, political discourses and the population discourses, community discourses. Resiliencia es una capacidad durmiente, vamos a decir, de, de poder responder a la emergencia con la menos falta de previsibilidad. If we do not understand properly what resilience is, especially for the communities, if they don't understand what resilience is, they will be falling back, falling back on and over again. In algunos casos, la resiliencia tiene que ver con la estructura de la casa. En otros casos, la resiliencia tiene que ver con ahorros familiares. En otros casos, la resiliencia tiene que ver con la capacidad eh, de resolver conflictos. Y en otros casos, tiene que ver con eh, si se, la familia cuenta o no cuenta con documentación para ir a solicitar los servicios del Estado. Las personas tienen que, de algún momento, de alguna forma, perceber que la resiliencia no es una cuestión, vamos a decir así, institucional. Las ciudades van a ser los elementos para ver si somos exitosos o no en la lucha contra el cambio climático. We believe that, um, that urban resilience is not only up to the national or local government, it's up to everyone. Um, that's why our main concept is that it's a multi-stakeholder, it's a multi-sectoral and a, it's a multi-hazard approach. Um, we do believe that it's in each of us uh, the, the obligation and responsibility to build resilience.